people, I want to talk to you guys about how I actually went from being a broke construction worker, literally less than two years ago, to now singing a Rari in Dubai, having made millions of dollars. And I want to tell you how I got here, the risk I took to get here, and how I basically ended up getting here, and how the saying that no risk, no Rari is actually probably one of the truest things ever spoken. And it's not necessarily about a Ferrari or a risk even, but it's basically about if you walk the traditional path and if you confine yourself to what is traditionally thought of success, you're never really going to reach a favorable location. The people who are risk averse, the people who play by the rules, they do the things they're meant to do, they play it safe. Every single person I know who has done that ends up fucking in a life that is not favorable. They end up in a job they hate. They end up with a four that they're settling for because they did what they were told to do. And I think that's what it comes down to is if you actually do what you're supposed to do, everything isn't going to work out for you. It's not actually looking good, Brev. What it takes for you is to actually get to the level that most people want to be, most men want to be at, is taking the risk, is being a little bit retarded, is being a little bit tapped. Because the risk-adverse motherfuckers are the ones that go to colleges, the ones who do what they're supposed to do. Do you understand? The cost of inaction is always going to outweigh the cost of taking a risk and actually taking action. When I was working in construction, I was making maybe 2K a month if I was lucky. I didn't have fucking any money. I was I was really discontent in my situation, right? Things had gotten so bad that I said, fuck this, I need to do something about this. I started looking for a high ticket sales role. I started um, I started trying to find a high ticket sales role. I thought sales was gonna be my path out and it did become that. But as I was trying to find a sales role, I realized I had no previous experience, I had no qualifications. I basically had no reason for someone to hire me. And as I was looking for these roles, I got reached out to by someone and they said, are you trying to get into the space, boom, boom, boom. I ended up hopping on a call with this person and they actually closed me on being my mentor. This person would then become my mentor and I paid him thousands and thousands of dollars to do so. At the time, I only had, I think, 1,300 Australian dollars, which is fucking nothing. I gave him all of it. So I basically risked my whole net worth at the time to get mentored by a guy where I had no previous results. I had no real reputability. Nobody else had done it before, what I was doing. I paid this guy to mentor me. Now, for the first two, three months, I got no results. I didn't see any change, but I did not quit. And this is what I want you guys to understand. You need to take a risk. You need to not quit. Because the last thing I want for you guys is to wake up when you're 30 years old and realize that you fucking wasted your life. And that's what's going to happen if you don't take risks. And that's what's going to happen if you quit. There's plenty of people who have taken that risk and given up. And now they're in the same position that they've always been in.